Hi, my name is Marshall Hebert. I'm the director of the Robotics Institute. I am privileged to work with about 300 graduate students in the uh, Robotics Institute at uh, Carnegie Mellon. Uh, we have, uh, we've had the first uh, PhD program, master's program and undergrad programs in uh, robotics and we have uh, still one of the uh, few programs in the, in the country. Uh, and uh, I work with those students to uh, basically prepare the uh, workforce of the uh, future research and uh, industry in robotics. So I want to tell you a little bit about the progress that is being made in uh, robotics uh, from a machine that can uh, perceive their environment, that can see, uh, machines that can, uh, and robots that can uh, act in their environment, that can uh, interact uh, with their environment, and perhaps more importantly, machines that can, uh, that can think, that can reason about their environment, that can uh, interact with people in more and more elaborate ways. This will allow us to have uh, uh, robots and system that can really uh, help us in our daily life, our work, that will enable us to do things that we could not do before. Uh, you start seeing that now with the advent of uh, self-driving cars, uh, drones, uh, uh, all kinds of uh, applications and scenarios that were part of science fiction just a few years ago. This will affect uh, uh, our lives in all of its aspects. In the home, we can look at having uh, companions and, and uh, personal robots uh, that will uh, interact with us directly, understanding our needs, understanding our uh, uh, lives. Uh, in work, we're going to have uh, uh, robots that can interact uh, with workers in factories, etc. Uh, in uh, transportation, of course, we have talked about self-driving already, uh, which will redefine completely the way uh, we think about uh, transportation, the way we think about um, uh, uh, organizing our, our life. My favorite thing uh, about uh, Carnegie Mellon is the, um, the spirit of uh, collaboration across uh, discipline that enable us to do things that are not uh, uh, possible at other places. Uh, in robotics in particular, the um, uh, the successes that we are having uh, are due to this uh, in, uh, very close collaboration between disciplines that range from mathematics, psychology, uh, etc., computer science, all the way to uh, mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, etc. Uh, we need to do all of this uh, together. And uh, Carnegie Mellon has a unique environment and a unique culture to be able to do this together.